Hey everybody, it's John with Upstate Brush Control. Got another little clearing project, but today we got some help. Today and hopefully tomorrow if he'll show back up. So we have Mr. I dig it for Davin himself. What's up guys? How's so, everybody doing? We uh we've been praying for you and our condolences. So, Thank you. I yeah, appreciate it. Yep. Thank you and uh everybody that you know has been supporting me so far like john and so many other people reached out and so uh i know i've said it before but you know i really appreciate everybody's support and the prayers and and everything with that so and everyone that donated to the gofundme uh for kailani and that's been awesome to see so thank you everybody for that i really yep. appreciate it so he's up here little, little what would you call a little getaway just kind of uh yeah i had to be in atlanta for a couple days uh for a celebration of life for misty and uh, so I went up to Tennessee for a couple of days and helped out Sam over at TriStar Digging for a couple of days. And then I had to come back down here to be here for Kai's birthday. And I was like, I'm gonna come down here and get into whatever John's into for the day. I was like, I don't care what we're doing, you know, just whatever, man. I'm just gonna hop in a truck and tag along. Nice, good deal. Well, we, uh, we moved some pipe this morning. We kind of been uh, going over the project and Shoot, it's, all, it's probably almost 9 o'clock now, isn't it? I don't even know. Probably. 9, 9.30. <laughs> We've been walking around. It's 9.30. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. So, well, we've been busy. We've started. Yep. We pulled out of the shop at, what, 6.45? Yeah, we're at 7 yeah. this morning to go get pipe. Yeah. We've not been idle. Yeah, this is true. So, he's going to be filming on his channel, so be sure to check out. Uh, I think he's going to be here today and tomorrow. And Oh, yeah. So, what we got? We got everything here. We got i say everything we got a lot of stuff <laughs> just about uh we got the mini the dozer the 210 the 120 and uh what we got here is a house lot that's getting pushed back almost uh 185 feet off this goes about that tree line right there staying to about the front of davin's truck so that big tree right there is actually right where the driveway is going to be going so that'll be fun but um we got a house pad back there slab monolithic slab that we got to prep for so we're going to kind of get in the back and focus on it first and all this material we're going to grind up and put back there so i think uh weapon of choice 210 i guess so i'm i'm the i was telling sam this i was like he put me on a dozer for the first time i was like i don't know about this but you put me in an excavator and I'm, I'm I'm not Chris, I'm not Let's Dig 18, <laughs> but uh, that's probably the machine I'm the most competent in. Okay. Right. But I've never run one that big. I've never run one that big, so that's gonna be a bit of a first, so. We had to figure out the pattern controls. He runs backhoe. <laughs> AK what John calls Goofy. Goofy, yeah, he runs oh. Goofy. It's like uh, skateboarding, you know? You run, <laughs> you run Goofy or, but uh, so he's gonna start making his way straight back over there and we're gonna start plucking out the home site and then behind the home site we got a um is our lay down area so yeah we man got a big lot to clear it's a big lot to clear it's not that big well it's not a 10 acre you know crisp <laughs> pond but you know <laughs> this is big for what i do yeah yeah for sure so pretty much nothing across here will yeah, everything's coming out. So all this scrub pine, everything. So, all right, we're gonna hop to it. Super annoying. First thing this morning, broke the lap, lap bar, snapped the nut off in the bolt there, or bolt in the nut. So my lap bar, I gotta like hold it up, like try I don't need to hold, hold it with my head like this. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Ah. Oh, made it. Oh, goodness. I'm good. Phone call. <laughs> All right, made my way to the back of the property. We got some flags right here. So I'm going to start opening this up and uh, dab and we'll get in here and start plucking out this material. This is our lay down area.
right guys things are going pretty good here uh, i've been mulching just a few minutes uh not terribly long at all and um i got an area opened up over here where kind of straight across this way back through here is where we'll do our lay down i might have to end up taking out on a couple more of these pines uh, like a couple of these over here and maybe one or two over there just so we have enough room to lay down all this material it's a lot of material that's coming out but um let's go check on dav and see how he's looking how we doing what's that this is this is fun yeah 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 this thing has got some power <laughs> it's, and it's really not i mean the only thing i've had a little bit of trouble with is the, the thumb rockers backwards it's bad it's yeah yep. so that took me a second to get used to but other than that dude this thing is it rock and rolls through here i mean we're oh yeah I mean, this is about an hour ish i guess not even yeah. that hardly yeah, yeah and we're we cut that windrow right through there and got it all lined up oh you know? yeah so yeah i mean i'm almost to the corner there and yep yeah this is this thing man, it's just snatching these things out you know? it's it's like nothing for yeah, it you know yeah it's like little toothpicks yeah even some of the bigger pines you know that are you know kind of big you just knock them over and you know and i love how you can just like crunch it all yeah uh, you know, just, it's, like, it's, just, it's like eats it's like a t-rex at the end just but, yeah oh yeah looking good man looking good so this uh that debris piles up real quick especially in these cedars there's a lot of dead stuff on the bottom of these things so running underneath them you get a lot of that stuff that falls down on top of your uh cutter head here and with that trap door open it uh blocks a lot of it or keeps it on there so i'm gonna get this thing cleaned off here real quick davin's having a blast checking in with him it's going good good enough all right things are looking really good here i'm uh, gonna check in with davin over here on the 120 we switched off he was in the excavator he wanted to give the 120 a shot with the pecan head see what his thoughts are he runs a print on head and uh keep in mind my my cutting machine i do have a small leak in my um it's for the pressure of the turbo so uh, for a hose, I got a pinhole leak, so I'm losing a little bit of pressure, uh, boost is what I'm losing. But got this cleaned off to here, you know, he came up right about to here, so working on cleaning this section off. This up here will be, uh, left is natural.
off nice and slow, taking his time. Looking good. Right, guys we're back here over here on this little little lot clearing project uh davin's still here he went down to get his camera and stuff and um day two on this didn't get a lot of filming he was doing a lot of filming yesterday so be sure to watch on his channel he got a lot of footage and uh honestly i was just watching him a lot and how he filmed and just how he does things so it's pretty cool um so we got everything greased up this morning i fueled that at the end of the day sharpen the teeth davin uh greased up the excavator so it's ready to go he really liked driving this thing so operating whatever you want to call it but 
So we're gonna hop to it, keep on clearing. The goal is to get all the brush down today. And there's two trees, there's a big poplar right there we gotta get off the road. So we're gonna hop to it, see what we can get done. So.
and he's running the uh, excavator for a little bit. And I'm gonna hop in this kiss here. Oh, that glare is horrible.
right, well, we're getting there. Davin's just about got that corner taken out. Uh, maybe got about 25, 30 feet squared off right there. I just took the dozer and just knocked this down and there were some humps and stuff like that and kind of leveled out the mulch. Um, it was getting pretty thick in that top area. So I'm uh, gonna hop in the mini, start grabbing some of this material, placing it up here. And uh, the customer's supposed to be here around noon and uh, we're gonna discuss if he wants to push back the mulching any farther and then this edge over here so you hate to uh do all that work and you think you're done and then they come back and like oh by the way i wanted 50 more feet and then that's just a bummer <laughs> you think you're doing so good and you're like oh we're done and then you're like no you're not but such is life all right so i'm gonna hop in the mini here it's like davin's Not sure what he's doing. I think he's good. Setting up a camera or something like that. But all right, let's uh start pulling out some of this brush. 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 